chat. Welcome, 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 welcome. I think I was sitting here and waited for like Discord to notify people that I went live for like five minutes. I'm like, what the heck's going on? I forgot it's Thursday. I forgot it's Thursday for like three weeks, so it's okay. I am back. Welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. I miss you guys. I miss you. Life has been crazy, busy, swamped, full of surprises, you know, hurricanes and all. <laughs> but I'm here. How are you? How was Jeff, Lady Ray, Racing Tank? Cheers. Cheers, Tank. Man, that's such a cute wave. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's so adorable. It's cute as heck. Cute, cute, cute. How is studies and school going, Rain? Are you busy studying as always? How do you? Afro, friend, kimono! Welcome, Afro! No, you! Jeff, what? No, you! Jeff, 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 how are you? You, um. Sleepy? I bet. <laughs> I think last I heard you say you were thinking about taking a nap, and now here you are. Oops. My bad. <laughs> Studying female anatomy currently. Mm. I imagine the next uh, time we have our movie night, it should be interesting. I don't know if I want to do it Tuesday yet, though. Probably, but I'll let you know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Tuesday might be good. I know. Could change it. We'll see. They're just. I think Tuesday's probably still the best day for me. It'd be male anatomy by then. <laughs> it might be. <laughs> oh, jeez. What a treat, right? <laughs> Little sleepy Jeff. Oh, no. <gasps> Karn! Oh my gosh! Karn is on fire! Nico, Nico, Nee! Karn, it's so good to see you! I hope you're doing awesome. I hope your streams have been going great. I hope, I hope, I hope. Welcome, welcome. It's good to see you. Can I get a shout out for Karn, guys? What did you stream? <laughs> We're gonna find out, we're gonna find out, right? But, uh, yeah, I'm back. I'm here to play some Genshin with you guys. Of course it's not working. Hold on. It wouldn't be a stream if something is not working. Hold on. This has to be this way. Playing Diablo? Do I have you in lurk mode? <gasps> Thank you so much for the lurk! Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome. Thank you, thank you. Enjoy Diablo. A wild semi-poor appeared. So if you need a semi-poor, that is what it looks like. Um, right, right. Oh, that's good. I just point to my mic. There we go. Now I know where to point. <laughs> point to my mic, and I'll be pointing at it. I love the reverse camera stuff. Okay, the bot is connected and should be working now. Prepare your ears. <laughs> it should work. <laughs> there it goes. Rain is here. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's totally working. Let's see. Check this. That. Alright. Do some Genshin. <laughs> I know I'm not really a little teapot. If you saw my post, it is because because I'm trying to get my teapot in Genshin, <laughs> and that's the thing I'm working on. So <laughs> that's why. If you're wondering, I'm waiting for somebody to ask. <laughs> somebody will ask. Just wait. Yeah. Yeah. No, 
one caught it. That's not fair. We tried. We tried. We tried to caught it. We just did not. It ran away. It ran away. Okay. Let's go over here. Oh, it's verifying file integrity. Hmm. Okay. So while it does that, we can talk some more. Because I didn't check that. Take a hot minute. Oh, I can check. Rain, have you played any Genshin lately? Or you been busy with school? My hair is still a little wet, so it looks a little weird. I just trim my ends. He wants to trim it for me. Hey, listen. Uh, sometimes I like my ramen a little al dente. Sometimes I like it a lot al dente. Like I eat it raw. You guys know. <gasps> Baldur's Gate and studying. How are you playing Baldur's Gate and studying? I don't even know. Welcome, Matthew, with the cookie. Little Piplup. Cute, cute, cute. I like the cookie. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah, well, Genshin's verifying file integrity. Alright, we're just gonna sit here a minute. <gasps> Look in front of me and reading during combat. Oh, because is combat like auto? <laughs> Best way to study, right? I gotta figure out how to study and uh, re uh, play Genshin at the same time. I probably could if I like, if listen to the book like on audio or something. Ooh, and play Genshin. Hmm. Ideas. It's terrible. What have I created? What have you created, Rain? What are we gonna turn into? You guys are gonna think I'm playing Genshin. I'd be like, no, I'm studying. You'd be like, no, you're not. You're playing Genshin. But, but I'm studying. I'm studying and playing Genshin. One of my friends plays Monster Hunter with one hand. Like, they have a special device to do it with. Wow. I didn't think if you could do it on the switch with one hand, but I doubt you could use a one controller, I guess. No, they use PS5 controller? That's crazy. I'm just like my hand is like ow. Like that's so cool though. Lots of practice, I bet. Lots of practice. Not completely, just during enemy turns. Aye 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 aye. That makes sense. Oh my gosh, it's at only a 40% because I'm streaming, so... You guys want to see something super cute? He's doing a challenge and it's freaking well. It sounds well. I'm gonna see something freaking cute, guys. I'm gonna share with you. Bear with you. But is it cute? Got Smurgle, Drifloom, and a little Eevee. So cute. <laughs> it's a gift. And and the Smurgle is like messing up the painting. It's like Smearing green paint across the Eevee mural, and I just dropped Eevee. Eevee's hiding behind the balloon, and I can't get Eevee now. There we go. But yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it was a gift, and it's... I, if I get it closer, this front light makes it where you can't see it. Hold on, let me turn off this front light a second. Oh, that didn't help. Now you can't see it at all. Trying to make it where you can see it better, not worse. But you get the idea. It's there. I thought I'd 
gotta figure out how to do this. I probably could have turned on my other camera. That would have worked. Now I'm in the dark. Ooh, spooky stream. Darkness be upon us. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna do Ghost Eevee for sure. Eevee after dark. I'm gonna paint Ghost Eevee. Eevees evolve as a ghost form for Halloween. That's the goal. So, we could start it soon. We don't have to wait till October to start it. An idea. My darkness, my old friend. Hello. I can't sing that tone. I don't, I don't even know how that one goes. I, I, I don't remember that one. I haven't heard it enough times. <laughs> oh, I should turn the light back on. There. Bright light. Bright light. Danger. 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 Too much light. I said the... Yeah. I said the words out in our order. Yeah, it's hello, dark. I knew the order, though, at least. At least. I may not be able to carry the tune, but I knew the order. Let's see. Oh, I need to do Genshin. 82%. <laughs> you just get to stare at me. You just gotta deal with me then. Here. I'll just keep doing show and tell. Kitty. 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 Tuna kitty. Turns into angry tabby kitty. Angry tabby kitty has a tabby colored tail. <laughs> This is me when Genshin's updating. <laughs> this is how I feel right now. <laughs> this is my feelings while Genshin's updating. And then when it's done, then when it's done, then when it's done, I'll feel like this. I'll be like... I should have! I didn't realize. <laughs> I should have. You were 100% right. This is me when it's done. I, the problem is that I like the sound of the music at the intro screen, so I like to do my startup screen with that sound. So I didn't hit the start button on purpose, or if I had, I would have realized there was an update like 30 minutes ago. I would have did it, and I would have did it a lot faster because I'm not live. But I like that sound for the beginning of the stream, and so <laughs> I waited to push the button. <laughs> You do, but if you go too far, then you're stuck with Paima, or not Paima, or whichever character, like, you know, like if I have Chi-Chi, you're stuck with one, two, three. Oh no, I forgot. <laughs> like, over and over and over. <laughs> so that's why I tried, I was like, I just like the peaceful, tranquil tones. No, I already forgot. <laughs> Look, yeah, but don't click the button to, for the door. <laughs> right. It's true. Still sound right here at the door. I could have clicked part of the way through. But, you know, I'm gonna blame the, the blonde hair. Sounds good. Besides, I got to talk to you guys. <laughs> Neko chan! <laughs> thank you, Turtle! Thank you for the 41 months! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Much appreciated! Just like in Matthew's email, it's just like. <laughs> it just makes me want to do that. Oh. 
That's how I feel at work when it's like 10 till 5 and it's time to go by fast. And I'm just like, da 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 just waiting, just waiting for the time. Oh, okay, we'll just like come back to this when it does that. It's loading. Yeah! You got you you got emotes of Emma doing that. <laughs> nice. I like it, I like it. Harder! That's so cute. I like it, I like it. <laughs> okay, now we're in. Put the kitty down. Put the kitty down. <laughs> I don't have that one. That one would scare me. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Is it supposed to be just like talking, talking, talking? Just pop. So she's like going pop. All right. So here we are. Doing our things and stuff. Following the sparkly trail to the teapot stuff. Because that is the most important thing today. It's the title of the stream. It's from the pop cat me. Oh, okay, okay. I know what you're talking about now. But yes, if you haven't figured out, guys, stream title, I'm a little teapot, is because I'm I'm on the teapot quest. That's what I'm doing. I gotta get my teapot, and they're making me run all over the place. <laughs> I'm a little teapot, so... <laughs> Giggles. That's a cute little giggly pig emote. Teapot equal tree farming? Tree farming. Oh? Hermit? Oh? I just discovered that the tiny highlighter strips I got have a black option and it basically allows you to redact info. <gasps> That is cool! You can just like black out stuff. You can't make anything without materials from- <gasps> I get to chop down trees?! I feel like I'm playing New World again. Who would have thought? Is that when you get to go fishing too? Not down. <laughs> you just shake the trees. <laughs> I'll snubble. Snubble, guys. Three mats per tree. You know, I noticed there was like wood. Never mind. You know, I think I remember that now. Wood falling out of the trees, and I didn't know what it was for. And a lot of ancient texts about the Lord. Okay, just play, 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 play. But the. Poke. Check. Do I have snubble? I do have snubble. Has a snubble. Don't need a snubble. I have an idea. Go look around Leeway Harbor and gather some things. I can use props. Having some props will really help my narration. Life. Bring my narration to life. What's this wood stuff for? Exactly! Right. I've been gathering it and I had no clue. I didn't know. And then I get distracted by the red dots, as always. Red. Red dots are evil. They die. Wants to go away. At least some of them. For stuff she wants to build in her teapot. Yep. 
I need to build all of these. I'm excited. Trying to decide how thirsty you are tonight? Mmm. Do I sense a little bit of angry cat? You need some wine, Jeff, right? Don't drink the whole bottle. Don't do it. Don't do it. Maybe, maybe three glasses tops. <laughs> May the Lord of Geo protect oh. you and fortune find you. Apparently, I already found what I needed. So, one item. What do I gotta give? Anything? Submit. Give. So half is fine. Yes, half is max. That's like four cups. Yes. Ah, <laughs> uh, that way you have some for another day, and you don't regret it tomorrow with a migraine. Cause you know you'll get a migraine. You don't want that. You don't want to feel hungover tomorrow. Then take the other half in five minutes. <laughs> five minutes is technically later. It is. And you would, Turtle. You would. If it was tequila, you would. Right? Am I wrong? Turtle likes tequila. I like mine and margaritas. The Geo Lords, the ways of adventure require themselves to be steadfast in the mountains in the face of whatever. <laughs> Maybe we can talk some more next time. Okay. The fleet! Hey! I bought some mechanical pencils that were on clearance. I love them. They have tiny weights in them, heavier and more like a pen. And Writing with it so much easier. Oh, so they're like weighted ones? That's cool. That was interesting. Okay, so we're gonna go. Where are we going? To that one. Okay. Teleport. I'm here, lady! <laughs> Welcome, Sixer! Welcome all! Welcome, welcome, welcome! Welcome to the streams! About time, Sixer! <laughs> hey, he's here almost every stream lately! At least for a bit! Our lurking, lurking! What you working on tonight, Sixer? What game you playing? What you into? Fun night? Just about, just about. We have three here. At least three. Sitting on the couch game? Yeah. Nice. I don't feel like it. But fine, we'll fight, we'll fight. If you guys wanna fight, we'll fight. Die. Gonna... Yeah, I think I need some healing. Just realized that. Okay, so where I need to go is down here. Okay. Freeze company. I just got home from work a little bit ago. Aww. Welcome home, welcome home. Vax, chill. Somehow I think we're off the teapot thing. I think this is a daily. Ugh. I don't know how this happened. Yeah! Ugh. Get off 
there. You guys can't fight it if you're frozen. It is a daily. I don't know how that happened. I got distracted totally. But yeah, now I'm doing dailies apparently. Get off the beam. You guys just want to be better. Yeah, goes on. Oh, where is he at? Oh, there's one up here on top of the thing. Speaking of teapot, let me go grab my corkscrew. How is that a teapot? Oh no 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 no! Go away. Opening box of a death by tricks. Yeah, you know. No, no, no. Go away. Thank you. Alright, where's the next one? Oh, he's up there! How did he spawn in up there? Okay, so we did a daily. We're done with that. Back on track. Where are we going with this hole? I know it completed that. That's what happened. It completed part of that. Oh, wait. Did we finish this right here? Destroy hidden towers? We did. Oh, that's the next one. Um... But there we go. Navigate back. Ads. Who needs ads? No. Ads are evil. Okay, let's go. You know, you guys can't see my map. I never know where to put my my camera. The right there works for a while. We're back on track to the teapot quest now. Maybe. Yes. No. Ah. Oh, Miss Yenfei, it's you. Has hey. something happened? Did the client from last time uh... have no further trouble from then on? Yes, of course. I'm just here to ask you a few questions. Has a merchant by the name of Crossel asked Nickleton! you to put him in contact with the jewelsmith recently? <gasps> Kelly! Yes, I remember. 16 him. months. Thank He's you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, he came to me with a chunk of something he called Smaragdus Jadeite. The design of the hairpin that he thank gave you, thank me you, was quite you. intricate, so it took me some work to find someone um. who was up to the job. Eventually, I found an older jewelsmith who made them exactly according to his specifications. This order was on you, for a very long time, and only completed quite recently, which is why I remember it so well. Doesn't seem like there's any he gets the cookies, because he got the Let's hooks. See. I'd like for you to confirm for me once more. When Mr. Crossel okay. commissioned you to find him a jewel smith, did he oh, this or did is why he I don't assert that the material he presented to you that day was called Smaragdus Jadeite? Yes, I'm sure of it. The hairpins were made using many expensive materials, I put my face. and the asking price was quite high, so we had to put this transaction on record at the Ministry of Civil Affairs. 
just gonna like you don't need me right familiar with the necessary procedures so I filed it on his behalf I also kept a copy for my own records see for yourself the item is called smaragdus jadeite twin phoenix pins thanks the inlaid gemstone is recorded as smaragdus welcome jadeite. thank you Jeff for doing that the document even has the official seal oh. of the ministry on it thank you Saint Saint. life's treating you well could you let me borrow this document sure it isn't serving much purpose here anyway I take it then that there's been some more trouble nothing you need to worry about just a minor issue I'll return your document as soon as I'm done with it. Thanks again. Why is everyone's first reaction always to assume someone or something is in trouble? <laughs> right, Paimon? See the nature of legal consultants? Hmm. I believe we have almost all the evidence we need. We just need to make one last trip. Let's go to Boo Boo Pharmacy to speak with Dr. Baiju. Boo Boo Pharmacy? I have a Boo Boo. Let's go to the pharmacy. I like it. Boo boo pharmacy. The weirdo with the snake. Sleep consultant. We mm, need one of those. Because only he can provide an authoritative. <gasps> Yay! Why? Is harmful to the body. Yes. Once we have this final piece of Good evidence for the in our boobos. hands, we can wrap this case up. We have some new items in. What? Quest location is currently involved in the J Chamber quest. Ah. Okay. I know what that means. Navigate to the J Chamber quest. More sidetracking. That's what that means. Why am I running like that? And I could just go cat style. So much faster. I seen a a reel the other day with like all the fastest characters in it, and she was like or four of the fastest and she was included because of the you know cat transformation. Oh. Let's keep looking. What? Oh, below us? There we go. Hi, Ray! Just got home. I can only play on mobile, but I can join in a bit. Okay, we're doing story mode right now, anyway. But welcome! Nowhere left to run. Matthew. Don't worry. We're not bad guys. You give us some Mora, we give you a little. I'm working on the J Chamber, so I can get back to the teapot quest. About this, look at her, the, the white hair, the the energy she gives off. I, I'm telling you, there there's something. Wild Dino appears. So what? She's loaded. How are we ever going to repay those gambling debts if we just let money walk away from us, huh? I've already told you, I don't need your information. If you still can't grasp that. I'm happy to repeat it in a way that won't be so easy to forget. Uh -oh. uh, come on, ma'am. You seem like an intelligent lady. I shouldn't have to spell this out to you. They are it's barking not. at the wrong tree. You need the info or not. They're okay. gonna get their butts kicked. It's about you taking out your money and handing it over. Callie, what have you been up to? I won't. It's been awesome. No more excuses. <sighs> I know you have money. I saw you. Yeah, I saw okay, you. cool. Luckily, Stolen it's only a short million. quest, but I'm taking care of the little kitten while it's this is running. Sweet. Then you a kiosk, then one mean yeah, I'm really working on the, te the teapot story. one. That's why I made my stream title, I'm a little teapot, but I had to do this part to move this quest out of the way. Because this location is needed. And since you're so rich, What's the loss to you in giving us a little spare change, huh? Master warned me not to lay a hand on anyone in Liyue Harbor. We're just doing all the things at will. one time. Hmm. Perhaps... Uh, yes. Let's call it fate. Boss, I'm telling you something's not right. 
What are you afraid of? We're just selling information. It's not illegal. If she lays a finger on us, all the better. We'll sue her for everything she's worth. Oh, you again. They can't sue me. I can kick their booty. What are the <gasps> I caught you? the Pokemon. Did you do this? Hmm? You ought to mind your own business. I swear. Silence. How dare you threaten innocent civilians? You're coming with us. <laughs> no, no. Don't, don't, don't. Don't be angry, sir. P p p please, let me explain. Mm-hmm. Go, kitty emote. Lady Rain soup emote. I love it. Shen He. Shen He? My name. Oh, so your name's Shen He. Hainan's name is... Well, Hainan! I'm on it. <laughs> travel buddy. Oh, I've heard about you two before. Travel buddy. <laughs> thank you for helping to defuse the situation. Aw, thank you, Jeff. I could have dealt with it thank myself, you, thank though. You, I suspect smashing his Love head against the ground notes. a handful of times. Now we need to give Jeff a shout out. To get him to surrender. Jeff, uh, uh, and six or two. You can't do that. That's way too violent. Need to shout out. Harbor. There are laws against that kind of stuff, you know. Laws. Yay! Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the love, Kelly. Thank you, thank you. That sounds on cooldown. Yeah, you can't do that. You're not allowed. <laughs> Just kidding. You can't shout me out. No, apparently not. Really? So how exactly have you? Oh, let me see. That would be my stomach growling. Hmm. I haven't eaten enough. She's so honest. That's right. They Aww. say you went around all Thanks, guys. <laughs> ordering this and that and the other, but only took a small bite of each dish. Then of course you're still hungry. So, anything in particular you're hungry for? Hmm. Chingson, glaze lily, violet grass. These are my usuals. Is that like a salad? Hmm. Medicinal herbs? Mm. Anyway, Boo Boo Pharmacy's not far away. Let's Hungry for apples? There for a mm. big medicinal meal. After all, you can't work on an empty stomach. Is it a cider wine? <laughs> apples. Do you think Shenha might be an adeptus? Apple wine. Seems that like would be good. I don't know that I ever had an apple it wine. I seem to get how things work. I guess they just go into cider it usually. That would explain everything. Where does she fit in with the other Adepti, though? Hmm. I'm on super curious. Are you here to buy some herbs? It's cheap peanut grazio. Aye aye. Chingson, glaze lily, and violet grass, please. Half a pound of each. What kind of prescription is this? Sounds more like a lunch order. <laughs> oh, here you go. That's everything we have in stock. <laughs> it's because it is Thank a lunch you. order. She's really eating them. Oh, my hunger has now abated. Thank you. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Turtle, are you proud of me? Wowzers. Rather awful. <laughs> Though they were not completely devoid of sweet fragrance, after consuming a large quantity of them, bitterness is all that remains. Oh, jeez. How, how can you chow down on these and barely touch the restaurant food? If Paimon mm -hmm. had enough, Mora, Paimon would go to the fanciest restaurant in town and order a whole table of food and eat it all in one go. Because <laughs> I'm not sure whether I will remain here in the future. The food of the mortal realm is most delicious. But should I return to the mountains, yearning for the food here shall only pose an obstacle to my continued spiritual development. Aww. Sampling each dish in order to appreciate its taste is enough. 
return to the mountains. That proves it. Paimon knew she was an adeptus. Mm, enough about me. What are your plans from here? Oh, right. Paimon hmm. forget. We Isn't everybody an adeptus in this town just about? Because we've been held up for so long. Hmm, I see. Hmm, I heard something about the contest when I was passing by. <laughs> yep! You get to ask Ningguang any question you want if you win! Yes, I'm doing story, story quests, Turtle. Too, hmm, I came for the rebuilding of the Jade Chamber, but until this point I had no intention of joining a contest. However, you have shown me your kindness. And I would now like to lend you my assistance. Oh, don't worry. I ask for nothing in return. Wow! You really don't have to. But having an Adeptus help out will make things a whole lot easier, so... Next up is Inazuma? Oh, God. I just read that. Then let's not delay. I have a plan. Paimon bets this is gonna be the awesomest plan ever! Um, I am not sure whether or to what extent this plan can be classified as awesome. I do, however, believe it will be highly effective. We simply need to dispose of everyone who is currently ahead of us. Then, we alone shall become the victors. Mito! That is not acceptable! Not by a long shot! Really? But I hear that competition is, in essence, about conflict and one-upmanship. Look, we want to win this competition fair and square, okay? <sighs> Sunset Vermilionite, Wonder Course, and Adepti Sigils. Let's start at the top of the list and work down. So, for Plus Strike... I was wondering who I could hear arguing over there. So... It's you. Bye, Hugh. What are you doing out here? Lady Ningguang wishes to purchase a large batch of wound dressing. We're running low at the store, so I came out to fetch the ingredients personally. Huh? How can Lady Ningguang need so much wound dressing all of a sudden? I'm not too sure. I did hear she's looking to rebuild the Jade Chamber. Maybe for its first aid on site? I didn't ask, though. Far be it from me to pry into my customer's personal affairs. Oh, and she also borrowed Chi-Chi. Meaning Boo Pharmacy is very short-handed right now. I don't suppose Chi -chi. any of you are looking for part-time work by any chance? Borrowed my Chi-Chi. No, no, we've got other stuff to do. Um, while you're here, though, you seem to know a lot. Have you ever heard of something called Sunset Vermilionite? Ah, the variety of Plostrite used in the Jade Chamber, yes? There is some mention of it in the Seven Mountain Treatises. When activated, Sunset Vermilionite rises up all the way into the clouds. It's very rare indeed. As far as the records show, virtually all Sunset Vermilionite in existence has been mined and taken possession of. But, the Feiyun Commerce Guild would know far more about this than I do. Okay then! Good evening, Black Ears! Yes. Got it. Thanks, Baiju! You're quite welcome. Good luck to you all! And if there's anything further you need from me, just come to the Boo Boo Farm. Here we go! Black Ears. You know, Miss DM. Yeah, put a little bit more light, move the light a little closer. I feel like against my chair, they're a little bit harder to see. But yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please, show me your prescription. I can't read what this says. Uh, 
Do I want to do this yet? Or can I switch back to the other one? And just like confuse you guys. Can I do that? Can I switch back to the other one yet? <laughs> While I'm here. Is. Ah, nope. <laughs> it's not gonna let me do it. It's why I finished this one. on my list is really far away. What? I hit it when the dots disappear. Is it really far away? Not really far away. Oh, I messed that up. Hold it. Master Sinkyo, thank goodness you're finally back. It's not far away. Oh, why do I detect an urgency in your voice? The guild has had a whole string of strange orders in recently. Everyone's been completely caught off guard. Your father gave me specific instructions to ask you to stay and help out if I happen to see you. I see. Have someone sort the orders by type for now. I'll deal with them myself shortly. Oh, how wonderful. Thank you, Master. With you on the job, I can breathe a sigh of relief. Hey, Xingqiu. Glad you're here. We want to ask you for some information. Traveler, Paimon, please wait a moment. Shu, I need to entertain some guests. Please continue with your work for the time being. Drink water. The matter of the guild's orders in more yes, detail yes, later yes, on. yes, yes. Understood, Master Singchio. Then I will leave you in peace. I have this one that has this much left for the day. What's going on? And then I brought this one. I be of service. Cause I forgot this one was in here. So we got all the water. Oh, I see. As long as I don't drink too much and stay up all night. <laughs> We don't want to run to the bathroom all night. That would be bad. Do you mean... <laughs> the truth is, the Feiyun Commerce Guild is in possession of some Sunset Vermilionite, but only one piece. We are holding it on behalf of someone who has asked us to put it up for auction, and a lot of interested parties have already come to us inquiring about the price. At the end of the day, it all comes down to supply and demand. In this case, I'm guessing the final transaction price may be in excess of 500 million mora. 500 million?! Jeez. Honestly, I would recommend that you don't bother bidding on this one. The price is greatly inflated, and it's just not worth it. But <laughs> oh, the drink waters! Oh no, turtle! All right, I don't nick it, guys, nick it. Gazer. Who? More water. Cheers. You don't own that ball, and out of ultra balls. Okay. Book shop ultra ball tin. Yay! Hmm. Sea Gazer was once very close to Mountain Shaper, but if I am not mistaken, he has already passed away. Yes, precisely. I didn't know anyone else knew about him. According to records of drifting clouds, Seagazer once built an abode to store his rarest and most exquisite treasures, among which was some sunset vermilionite. After Seagazer passed, the abode was abandoned, and its location was lost to time. Luckily, I came into possession of a stack of folk history books just recently. They make some oblique references to this lost abode, and after cross-referencing them against each other, I'm now fairly certain that it is situated in the Leisha area. That's great! Um, but is it really okay for us to just 
go and take his treasure, wouldn't it be a little, you know, disrespectful with him being an adeptus? <laughs> you needn't worry. As far as I understand, Seagazer was very open. No one caught naked? Even while Not he fair. Was alive, he wouldn't have let something like this bother him. Open minded. Pride. I have not heard of Seagazer being described in this way before. May I ask where you read that? Just a rumor I heard out in the mountains. <sighs> All right then, let's go. Hmm. There's something about this young lady that reminds me of a good friend of mine. Oh, I almost forgot. Adepti abodes tend to have very ingenious designs. Especially when it comes to their defense mechanisms. Plus, it's likely to be crawling with monsters after being abandoned for so long. So please, be very careful. Okay, we will be. Thanks, Shinto. Alrighty. Okay. Are you going to go up? Where is that? Up. Up here. over there so we're gonna go over here and teleport doing well. I feel like it's down even further, but I don't know for sure. Or no, there it is. <laughs> I'm glad it didn't go down. This place was hidden using a special Adepti art. But now that I have removed it, we can inspect the area more closely. Wow, that's amazing! Yep, let's take another look I'm around! I'm not doing good in the slightest, sadly. Oh no! Your health's bad? Not good. to go in here or something anyway? No. That Seely distracted me 
And I just keep finding myself in more and more of a predicament. What in mints? Oh, what? I don't know what you're talking about, six flag. Oh, I tried to go in there a minute ago. That's what I was thinking. Hi, Torin. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good to see you. I hope you're doing awesome. And life is treating you well. Don't be there shaking my head. It's okay. Uh, yeah, the elements recommended are ice, or no, yeah, Geo. Geo. Geo, can you, can we can find out somebody? Uh, there you go. As you wish. I've been well, yeah. Good, good, good. I'm glad to hear it. We're just having a, you know, a Genshin chill Thursday. Just recommended you don't really need it. Okay. Uh, Thank you. What? Sometimes you do. Are we at a you just now? How did we suddenly end up here? Oh, so many clouds. It feels like we're high up in the sky. Hmm. I believe this is the abode of that Adeptus. With any luck, the sunset vermilionite we're looking for should be in here. Really? Let's hide and see. Huh? If I build a broken, the the, this is broken enough. It directly yeah. oppose the recommendations. Oh. Any numbers stack stacking? Yeah. You play this, Torin? Something below the clouds? These are not real clouds. They are the product of an adepti art used for spatial partitioning. If we want to go down, we must first destroy the mechanism that is maintaining the adepti art. All right, then let's do it. I sense the presence hey, of more recommendations, right? I don't know where they are hiding, so we'd better be you careful. You know you do, turtle. I play Star Rail and watch X or video or two on this. Oh, Star Rail's nice. I haven't played Star Rail in a while, though. Okay, so... I'm supposed to go down, but we're supposed to go over? Now are we supposed to do that? Are we just supposed to fly? I haven't used her before, so... Oh, you can walk. Cool. You know, you can walk on the clouds. I was scared I was gonna fall. Manifest. Oh. I should start Star Rail. Oh yeah, it's on PlayStation now, right?
There we go. The imposter check? Probably a good idea to put my feet on the floor. Okay. Thank you for the loves. I'm just having fair difficulties with no solutions and more difficulties getting added by the day. Oh no. She's a Creo buffer? Oh. Not until later this year. Posture check, thank you. Yes. Stretch, stretch, put both feet on the floor. You're honestly shocked your phone is handling it as well. I did get accepted to the PS5 beta this week. Ooh, what's in the beta? What happens on that? You're shocked your phone is handling it. Yeah, I think Star Rail isn't as big as Genshin on the phone. be a mobile star rail player oh I don't have my water person now They can't hear me because of the ads. Test the app on it as a tester before the final product. I get to use my mobile account in the process. Oh, so like testing the ability to use your PS5 on mobile? Imagine. Oh no! Welcome back. Well, Carnivine appeared. I mi I miss what the beta is. I don't understand. Just to test the app on the phone. So there's like a new PS5 app? What does the app do? The beta app. Or you don't know yet. Okay, so I need a thing. And I just broke the thing, but I didn't get the thing. There we go. I probably just didn't move fast enough. No testing the actual PS5 version of Star Rail for any bugs and such. Oh, okay. I will catch it by throwing hands down. <laughs> <laughs> it appears that we've been taken for intruders. This time, why not allow me to take care of this? Oh, oh yeah, hold on. Aw, I wish I had my water person! 
Orders given. Oh, Orders is that an given. ant or a spider? God. <laughs> After I had all those spiders hatch out on my desk over there, I'm like paranoid. Wow. Anytime I feel something crawl on me now, yeah. just saying. You know, I should probably try her Unleash. while I have her. The core of the mechanism is exposed. Now's our chance. Oh. All right. Oh, I just gotta beat it up. That's pretty good. But I want to see what this does. Obey. With this. Do your master's bidding. Ooh. Unleash. Lots off. It's dead. I'll be back later. If you're still alive, I need to lurk in a mono stream to de stress a bit. But I hope to catch you later. Oh, she died. Because <laughs> I was reading chat. I didn't know we were falling here. Um, yeah, I didn't know that was going to happen. I thought I would have paused and let me talk to you guys and read chat. Community done in community and ruined her. Oh no! Joy hope on big screen. I'm gonna have to catch up with chat in a minute, guys. I'm sorry. I feel like I've missed so much. Okay. Like. Chi Chi doesn't count though. No! Poor Chi Chi. So we're gonna fall again, right? And we have to be prepared. So we're gonna defeat this thing. Which I just need to use her and do it. Maybe? Why isn't it working? Why isn't it doing anything? Leave it up to me. Coming through. Oh, there's one more these guys? Is that why? That's why. Uh. Get close to the robot? No, I don't want to go next to the robot. As a good night should. It does not want to die. Let's get it on. Yeah. <laughs> 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 needs 
to be healed, but she's not healing. Ah! <laughs> no! I didn't want to fight him! <laughs> Cats everywhere in Genshin. Oh, Gorilla. Oh, I didn't want to. I, I miss my... I miss my... Uh, Nilu. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is there any people that, like, not die? She's gonna die immediately. I just can't handle it. Uh, come on, Dave. Need you to fight and not go down. I can just uh, switch to her again too. Come in and see destruction <laughs> damage. Right? It's sad. It's sad. I feel out of character for some reason. I'll catch up. I haven't played enough in a while. some of the older stuff. Uh, this is a story quest, I guess. Main Archon quest. Destroying this cute thing. Actually, let's use her. Let's get it on. I think I know which one, as long as it's not the horrid place of Simmer. <laughs> oh no. Oh. It does? Are you sure? Yeah, I guess so. You're right. Never got her. Dean. I can't, like, fly? Oh, in the last second. go through this stuff? I spelled it wrong. I hate that place so much. That's how much I hate that place. Gave up on Samaru after the third desert area. There's so much exploring and underground crap. When you do the Anara Anara quest, then you will hate it as well. Oh. I had to get 
the treasure chest. It doesn't budge an inch. Where are we supposed to go now? cat ear time. <laughs> and then you redeemed cheetah cat ears? <laughs> of course you would. Assumption that every person has someone of course you would. Am I supposed to wear both at the same time? We've been here and done this. A long time ago. The devs go through. Let's mess with people and make them hate this. <laughs> Turtle, purple, and black. Oh my god. <laughs> and light up ears! I've never had the light up ones too. Oh god. <laughs> and I'm trying to do this in the reverse and I can't see what I it's best not to look and just do it. Purple. And then the light up ears. And lots of drink waters. And a little budget crooks. Crooks though? Oh no. I don't think I can put it on over the other ones. It doesn't stretch that far. We're gonna try, like, get it down in there. Don't break. I feel like my head's bigger. <laughs> there! Perfect! Perfect. Perfect. All of it. All the ears. And Mona still doesn't want to listen to me. What do you mean? <laughs> yeah, there. I don't think this is going to last long. They're trying to pop off right now. It's a cat ear tiara? Yes. Drink water. Got it. What else did I... Oh dang! The light up ones are 5,000 points? I'll have to leave the light up ones on for a while. It looks weird. <laughs> it does look weird as heck. <laughs> you guys. The assumption that every person has somewhere. <laughs> you see you drink water, you gotta do it again. You guys are gonna make me have to go pee. That's what's gonna happen. A long time ago. I'm trying to hold them on. They're just not gonna stay. They're all falling off. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have to like uh rethink this now. Gosh, there's so many. Oh There, 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 there. My hair's like all over the I don't know. I don't know where I want my hair. My hair's scraggly because it was not completely dry when I got on here. I need to brush it. There. I did drink more water. <laughs> ah! friend from foe. All right, now I'm gonna heal my characters. Power. I get any further? I loathe crowded areas. See. I'm 
So what's her name? Aldea all the way. I can't switch characters right now, can I? Can I? That every person has somewhere to call home. No! <laughs> I went Milu. Alongside the birds and beasts along what level A are you now? 35? I think? 35 still. She should be 45 and nothing will convince her. I gotta take it slow, cause, cause things. I don't play enough. I need too many things. Oh, all budget. Oh, here's another rock. So in what way? Um, but I don't have time to play. I gotta finish all these these missions and story quests and everything. Tons to do. Don't budge an inch. There we go. Trying to make her stab them both at the same time. You will regret this. Unleash. Uh, don't do that. talk about it we're not stuck in a corner or anything How about you? 
Engine's good. Went through a hurricane. Came out all good. I got lucky, not like some people. All those good things, so thankful to be healthy and happy and well and you know. Nothing's changed here, thank goodness. received. Oh. Don't sit on her. You know what? Your mommy teach you that? Your dead mate. Thanks for giving me a shout out. Thank you, thank you. That's cool. How are you, man? How are you? You're doing good. You ain't messing around. Please, get off me. No, not Gigi. Ugh. I feel like I'm stuck against the freaking wall. It won't let me out. A disgrace to the knights. <gasps> no. It's cheating. <laughs> you were playing GTA Five today. Nice. It killed my GG. <laughs> so mad. So mad. Killing all my players. So now I need to... Do some reviving as soon as I get a second to get away from these things. I can't run fast enough though. There. No! Cancel. There. Not Chi Chi again. I must Stop! <laughs> no, 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 no. Stop. Wow, I keep hitting the wrong number, that's why. Because they're all down. I can't do anything and keep hitting the wrong freaking number. Ah! <laughs> I'm just gonna die. I'm not ready for this. Oh. Here, I thought I was gonna have a relaxing day. No. They're just gonna murder me. I can't revive Chi Chi yet. Holy- Yeah, no. Stop dying, I know, it's too late. I'm all dead, there's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do, it won't let me come back. Oh, can I run away, run away and go heal up? What the heck? I didn't know I could do this. Oh! They're gonna blow me up while I'm doing this, though. Go so restart the thing back to full? Probably. Because I'm gonna die anyway, though. <laughs> and it's not gonna let me revive these guys. It's 
see. Can I do it? Confirm. Yep. I still have three. <sighs> she said no, seeing Willow is ignoring us. No! Thank you so much. I'm not ignoring you. I promise. <laughs> oh, Pam for impaired. One glass in. I think I need to reveal. Oh, no, Jeff. I'll scroll back up in a minute. As soon as I finish dying and feeding all these crazy core things. God. What now? Is that it, I hope? Might be working on stuff to make you stronger. <laughs> What a hog. He's like, no, yes, no. I'm not. I could, I'm gonna like go to my bag now because I should be able to revive these people, right? No, I still can't. I still can't revive anybody for 42 seconds. Can I sit here for 42 seconds? I mean, why not? Hello, less than three. Welcome, Shane. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for the 67 months, Shane. <laughs> I wanted wonder. I wanted to be able to fly. <laughs> the flying was important. Alright, going back in to read what two, I missed. Two, I don't want to play three, around. Jeff kind of wants to play around with GTA 5. I, Nick says I was playing roleplay in GTA 5. And it's since I play the mod version of the game. And Mama, 
Welcome to the stream, Momo. Come on out, hee hee. Got this, Momo. See No, blah blah blah. Oh gosh. Time to catch up. L3G3CL subhype L3G3CL Shade! Make me stronger too while you're at it. Okay, I'll try, Shade. <gasps> Legs, thank you for the 47 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for all those subs and the love, guys. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome to ignoring chat with Mono. <laughs> Not on, not on purpose. I'm not ignoring you guys on purpose. See, I don't know if you guys can hear me during the transition screen. So sometimes I repeat myself when it's transitioning, but. Welcome everyone, welcome to chat. Being the best healer? Yes, I would love to have G. I would love to have G. Legendary. Hey, yes. What fades out? What fades out? What fades out? Jeff. Your wine didn't fade out, did it? <sighs> Guys, you started a hype train. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are awesome. Thank you for all the support. I know I have been a uh, lack of streams here lately. Hey, look, I found our little light up bracelet, too. I forgot I had this. Now we could just make it a thing, do all the things. Ah, now I'm gonna like disconnect it to put it on. Nope. Nothing for that. You know Ooh. There we go. Uh, Hard putting a bracelet on by yourself. I Rainbow cat ears. Okay. Already forgot. I got you. Does I figure out how to do this? How does it connect again? Okay, just like that. That's what I thought. I just see you're safe and sound. Thank you. Glad you see you made it through another work day. There we go. Now we're just all light up. <laughs> Except I'm about to change to the um, Two, the rainbow three, cat ears. Four, oh, I forgot to add. I gotta add the lace ones eventually. I finally fixed my lace ones. I finally uh sewed the ear back on, so the lace ones are back. I just gotta add them to the list. Add them. So hopefully I remember to do that after stream and get them back on there. But you guys, thank you so much for the love. Thank you for the support. You guys are awesome. Welcome to watching me get my butt kicked. <laughs> are we gonna do this yet? Um. Let's see if we can revive anybody yet. Let's go somewhere cooler. Can I revive the other one yet? Nope. We're just slowly gonna revive everybody so our team's like fully healed and ready to go. You want a gift for the game? Hold on, wait a second. Lin Mono. <laughs> I'm glad to be off. Nice. I feel like you really get a break, Shane. He doesn't. He works so hard. Saving people. Mono, do you want a gift for the game? A gift? For what game? Genshin, I don't know how to do that. Already forgot. Other than like, you know, donations, then I could just spend the money from my PayPal account. But I don't know how to do it safely any other way. 
I don't know. Oh, it's the Discord gish gift from Genshin? Yeah. I forgot about One, that. Two, three, four. Can I redeem it more than once? Two, three. Probably. Four. Look at your DM. Okay. I can't redeem it right this second. Or maybe I can, actually. I can redeem it online. Ooh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. I didn't get enough days off, but when I work, I usually so draining, especially today. Alright, yeah, I'll redeem it in the web browser. That's what I'll do. One, two, three, three. I won't be able to look at it right now, because I'm in the middle of a battle thingamajiggy. That's what they're calling it these days, battle thingamajiggies. Battle thingamajiggies. Paste. Redeem. Oh, I already used a code of this kind. It won't let me do it. Can I re-gift it? Can I re-gift it? Somebody that doesn't have Prime or, or, or Discord? I'm guessing somebody that doesn't didn't get it on Discord. Or does it have One, Discord Nitro? Two, I guess I can gift it to. Is that it? Or did everybody get it? Two, two, three, four. Gift it away. Okay, I'll gift it away. Powered by Viper. Yes. I'll do that though. I'll give it away. Don't worry. <sighs> Momo! Okay, I think we can heal the other person. Now. Do that. Get back to the game here. Okay. Hey, do you know what? Food. Don't. Or not. There we go. Uh, I'm also drained. It's one of those days, I right? Already forgot. Mono! You know what? You know what, Momo? You're special. That's just for Momo. <laughs> she needed that. She needed that. One, two, three. Yes, four, do you have did you get the two, Discord code, Night Rain? Three four. Not for you. Oh, you're special too, Legs. You're special too. I just like freaking Momo out. She goes, ah! <laughs> <sighs> yes. Oh, cat. Did you see the creepy SF6 char named? Okay. No. Yeah, but it might just be for Nitro. I'm not sure. Nitro users. I'm not sure. The code's for Genshin, but I think if you pay for 
Discord Nitro, you get the code. I don't know if you get it if you don't. Forgot to pull the new Star Rail code. Ooh, I don't have that either. Let's go somewhere cooler. Sag? It's not Sag. I can, I can, I can gift it to you. You need a code. You need a code, Night Rain. Do you need a code? Hook you up. <gasps> Thank you so much! 102! Holy cow! Yes, she needs it now. She does. She needs it. Needs it. Four, two, two. Ready to see legs, aka Viper. Now that you've gotten to hear Chi Chi. One, two, three, four. <laughs> you're welcome, you're welcome. Pipe, pipe, pipe. Drink water? Okay, I'm gonna drink water. If I can. Put my feet back on the floor for a whole five minutes, because that's about how long it lasts, and then they're back in the chair. Yeah, I already redeemed mine, I think, is why, so... Chi Chi noises intensify, right? Uh... Oh, treasure chest. I don't want to sit. We're just gonna steal somebody's treasure while we're here. A drift loom! I need that. I definitely need that. You seem tired. Would you like some tea? I'll brew you some. Do you take sugar? One cube or two? Okay, one more code in your DMs. Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, let's do this. Or do we want to just sit here and admire the tree, you know? We got these perfectly good tables here. And it asked us if we wanted to sit, and we didn't bother to sit. Then you just sit, and you just look up. You can claim your Starwell Prime now. Yes. Sweet. I'll have to do that. 
Wish me luck, guys. I feel like it's gonna be another fight. Is this the sunset vermilionite? Huge! It's so huge! Yeah, it's a code too, just like the one you gave me for Genshin. Why isn't it floating? Paul Strait doesn't float until it's activated. It may look different from most ordinary stones, but it weighs around the same amount. Only after being activated does Plostrite reveal its true nature, breaking free from the shackles of the mortal realm and ascending up into the heavens. Wow, Shenhe. You seem to know everything about this. Only because my master is fond of chatting Don't about these it. things. The moment she has some time to spare, gonna give it out in chat and start telling story after story. Yeah, I don't, I don't know who else plays Star Rail that doesn't have Prime. I certainly didn't expect them to ever come in handy like this. Knight, does Knight play Star Rail too? Hold on a sec. Paimon just realized something. If we activate it here. There's no way we'll be able to get it back to the site, right? Heck, we'll be dragged up into the sky, too! But if we don't activate it, how else are we gonna lift it? This rock must weigh well over a thousand pounds, surely! Don't worry. I can handle the weight quite easily. Are you sure? Uh, be careful! Oh, my. Please don't worry. I'm well aware that a plot got it yesterday. This large must be oh, valuable. yeah, you may not I got it yet then. It and make sure it does not get damaged. I haven't checked my browser yet. Paimon, yes, she! Paimon, hungry Paimon. You have it? Sweet! What I, what do you want to do? Give it away? Yeah, you can send it to me until somebody says I find somebody that needs it. Was I gonna make sure it's somebody that doesn't have Prime that plays Star Rail? Sixer, do you have Prime? You could give it to your brother. Okay. Turtle knows somebody. If you want to DM it to Turtle. My safety. Right. Okay, thank you. I'm I'll take care of like everything. But if something this heavy lands on you, you're gonna get yourself hurt, no matter who you are. You gotta be extra careful when lifting heavy objects. It's just common sense. Hmm. Is it now? Hmm. Well then, thank you. I'll go on ahead with the plostrite. Let's meet at the building. Thank you, thank you, thank you, legs. Yeah, anytime you get any of those Genshin or Star Rail codes, we would use them. about the little piece? Are you just gonna leave the little piece? You could take that one too. Or the other little one. You didn't have to take the giant one. You know? People. Alright. Looking, 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 looking. There we go. Go back to finding chat. Thank you, Lex. All right, so we get to leave the domain now. All these little green floating rocks around. All right. Rest well. Enjoy your foods. Oh, it was good to see you. Oh, thank you for the lurk. Right? Yeah, you could probably go. 
You might be able to go back and find some of the older ones, too. I don't know if they're still active or not, but... We could test them. They expire monthly? Okay, so never mind. But yeah. They have one a month, I think, for at least Genshin. Probably Star Rail, too, it seems like. More like disappear. Oh, they. Jump over there? No. About here. Just climb up the hill. They both have one a month. Somehow my prime isn't active for me. It took a minute. You might have to refresh. About to say, Mona, why is there squares on my notification? Huh? I don't know. What is it way up there? Probably this. Has anybody collected all these ever? Does anybody do that? Nope. We don't want to find you. No, I don't have Prime at all for some reason. Oh no. You get 100% the area. No. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Turtle and you have 100% areas before. I am not close to that yet. It's up high? I'm not 100% in Simaru unless I'm completely bored out of my mind. Oh my god. All you have to do is Mondstadt and that's it. It takes so long to do. Dang. Uh, yeah, I don't. I think it would be fun if I had the time. I don't see myself ever having those kind of hours. Oh my god, I can't believe my eyes. How can she You got Monstrat and some of the way 100%? She's got to be one nice. of the Adepti, surely. Oh mighty Adeptus, please give me your blessing so that in the coming year I may reap a more bountiful salary. This is top tier in size and quality, and the condition it's in is quite simply immaculate. Congratulations. This item is approved for submission. I'm going to award you full marks for the Sunset Vermilionite item. May I take your name? My name isn't important. I'm not even here to compete. I was just delivering this for some other people. They should be here any minute now. Shenha, and I'm going to me. ever get caught up in the story? Probably not, ah, Ella. <laughs> so the ones behind this. No I have wonder. everything 100% except for parts of the, the desert area. Wow. But I have to it's incredible, to Turtle. Point. It's not helper, it's secretary. <laughs> okay then, Miss Secretary, what do you think of the rock we found? Pretty amazing, right? In truth, it is the finest piece of plostrite we have received so far. 
If everything goes according to plan, we will use this piece in the foundation of the Jade Chamber, which will enable us to proceed to the next stage of construction. As a side note, Lady Wong has rented some dwellings in the That's incredible. I have way too much time. It's sad. Mm. If you need a place to rest, you are welcome to stay there. Now, please excuse me. As you can see, there is still a I lot I wish I knew what that was. I do. I don't have, I never have time. General, it seems like you got lucky to have a balance of some time. It seems like either people have no time or too much time. There's no good balance. It's hard to find that balance. These are the last six. Aren't you happy about it? Whenever Paimon gets praised, Paimon can't help but hold their head up high and break into a big smug smile. Yeah, we know Paimon. Before. They call me an adeptus, treat me with great deference and respect, as if I'm set apart from the common folk. Yeah, cause that's how adept I are. At least the ones we've met are pretty unique and reclusive too. Way different than normal people. But uh, I am not... Uh... Jenna? Why, girl? I'm fine. I've been exerting myself quite a lot ever since we set foot in that abode. Uh, I'm just a little fatigued. Um, oh, well, Byron said that there are some makeshift hotels we can use, right? Let's go check in and take a rest. <sighs> no need. I simply need to find myself a secluded place in the wilderness to sit and meditate in silence. You can't do that. It's dangerous out in the wild on your own. When you're hungry, you go eat something tasty. And when you're tired, you go lie down in a nice, comfy bed. All right? Seriously, don't punish yourself like this. Poor girl. Poor girl. Okay. If you insist. We're talking. Let's head to our hotel. It's there was an hour out of one year and amount of time. I sent five gaming twenty percent work. The rest is a little. Dang. Let me see. Yeah. Okay, let's get going. I'm lucky to get. On my list is really far away. A few hours a week for gaming. Oh, catch. And that's almost always live. Sometimes I will play not live, but not very often. Do my dailies here and there. Need to go up. Explore the yellow spot. I think I was supposed to go down, huh? Huh? Break a nearby makeshift hotel to take a break. Wasn't there a hotel down there somewhere? I don't know. Maybe up here. Definitely not up here. We're going up here anyway. We'll catch Lily Leap. Lily Leap. I can't let it leave. I'm pretty sure it's 80 meters downhill. I 
this little place right here. There we go. Turn on, turn on, turn on. Hi there. Checking in, are we? You're just in time. We only have two rooms left. Since this was chosen as the building site, this is my sisterhood adventure rank 60. Dang, she's catching up to you, man. Visitors, business people, Are you proud? Sellers, all sorts. So, business is booming for me today. Very few vacancies. You're lucky you got here when you did. Great! One of your rooms is still being cleaned. I, I guess it should be ready within the hour. The other room is just at the door on the left. Here are your keys. All right. Hope you enjoy your stay. Please excuse me. I'll leave you to it. Shayla, you should go get some rest. We'll hang around outside until the other room's ready. Hyman's gonna go see if there's anything good to eat around here. <laughs> of course you are, Pylon. Oh my gosh. Oops. Pokemon got away, mama. All right, I will head to my room for now. If you need anything, don't hesitate to disturb me. I'm a light sleeper. I will hear if you knock on the door. Mm hmm. See you tomorrow. Hey, isn't that clever, Tina? What's she doing here? Hmm. Bad retainer. Alright, I'm gonna take a quick break though, guys. Run away, take a quick break with me. Uh, you know, get water if you need it, or uh, lose some water if you need to, because I'm kind of drinking a lot of water. <laughs> so, I will be right back. I'm gonna take a stretch break. <laughs> yes, yeah, stretch break run. Thank you, Jeff. Uh, Momo, you're on. You're live. It's your turn. <laughs> I'll be right back. Hmm, I wonder what's inside this package. Uh, no, no, no. No peeking at my customer's stuff. Scenery here is wonderful. <laughs> I've landed the perfect job.
Let's get going. The next location on my list is really far away. What's inside this package? Uh, no, no, no. No peeking at my customer's stuff. I'm back, I'm back. Let's see. Hi, it's in my safe place. <laughs> what happened? He's basically saying I need to get away from you people, get snacks, and forget. Forget my viewers for a bit. No, I had to use the, the ladies' room. Because of all this water you guys made me drink. Oh, the scenery here <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> I've landed the perfect job. That's what happened. But now I just you guys always drink Oh, why do they look crooked? Why do they look crooked? And my hair is like a frizzy mess. It's cause it's clean, it just looks like fluffy, fluffy, fluffy. It's just a mess right now. Dirty hair looks better. Am I wrong? Fresh clean hair is a pain in the butt. Once it gets a little bit of natural oil in it, it's good. Let me see. <laughs> More hugs for Momo. Okay, let's get going. The next location uh, is really far away. There. That looks better. Twist it. I still look prettier. And then I fluff it out and it looks bad again. Maybe I'll straighten it for tomorrow for work. More hugs? I don't see any. Six gave you more hugs. Sixer did. Sixer just gave you hugs. Weird. I can see it. Or maybe. Here is wonderful. Maybe I've landed the perfect job. Maybe I got them out of order. I don't know. All right, so we gotta go up the hill. Oh, back down now? There it is. Pyong. Cat's gonna attack the bird. Pyong. <laughs> Dang, couldn't eat the bird. Bad retainer. There you go. Here's here's a here's a photo spot. The bird and the cat rest on a ledge. It is 
is a little work. It's not too bad. It's just not good for your hair, but it looks better. Let me see. Okay, let's get going. And then if you don't want it completely straight, you straight it and then curl it, which is kind of sounds weird, but that's how that works. You straighten it and then you curl it. To give it a little bit of curl, but not too much. <laughs> oh, I can't tell from here. Okay. Actually. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll talk to Cloud Retainer now. One trusts you have met Shen Ho. So, are you getting along quite well? So far, so good. Yeah. So, you know Shen Ho too, Cloud Retainer? Naturally. Save for Ganyu, who spends the majority of her time in Liyue Harbor. All the Adepti living today are acquainted with Shen He, to some degree. Cool! So, what's her Adeptus name anyway? Calling her Shen He feels kind of friendly, but also kind of disrespectful. So Paimon's thinking, maybe it'd be better if we called her by her Adeptus name instead! Her Adeptus name? Why, pray tell, would Shen He have an Adeptus name? Special title they go by? On this latter point, you are correct. However, Shen He is human. Oh, oh, right. Wait, what? What? You knew already? So is Paimon the only one who didn't know? <laughs> Do you mean to say that she presents differently from ordinary human beings? Well, to start with, oh. her problem solving methods are. Regus? <gasps> Isn't that like a legendary? Ah, oh, yes. She Maybe? was like this all those years ago when one first met her. In this respect, she has not changed. Ruin oh no, it's not. Never mind. I see it now. It's not. I forget I can look on my screen to see what it looks like. Being of an ever vigilant disposition, one entered immediately to inspect the scene. Inside was Shanha, then aged around six years old. In her hand, she held a dagger with which she was confronting a monster that was the god's remains incarnate. That sounds so dangerous. When one arrived, she had already been locked in confrontation with this monster for several days. Most mortal children are fragile, both physically and mentally, and what? are highly huh? reliant on their good. parents for survival. Up in the, but the screen, so her. up over there. That she was able to endure over such here. terrible danger was due not only to her strong. The will, numbers is which Pokemon that also is. Also to the bloodlust and homicidal instinct with which she was born. One dealt with the monster, yet she still refused to lower her guard. She even pointed her dagger in one's direction and remained ready to strike. Only after she was satisfied. That one had no intention to cause her harm, did she finally relent? She then passed out without uttering a single word. In other words, if you hadn't passed by that day, Shenhe might have. Not necessarily. Upon one's arrival, one could sense that the god's wrath was gradually receding, even had the stalemate continued. One suspects that Shen He may have still emerged the victor of the confrontation. That's still so dangerous, though. Why was a tiny little 
little kid battling against the wrath of a god in the first place? Alas, hey. the mortal Got world it. is rife with suffering of every kind. And she had experienced her fair share of this, even at a tender age. Seeing that she was homeless, one decided to adopt her. Indeed, it is one to whom she refers. Xiang He has an extraordinary constitution, making her well adapted to practicing the Adepti arts. All the Adepti cherished her talents, and so we were willing to train her. However, Damn. her homicidal urges did not subside with age. Rather, they grew stronger day by day. Moon Carver once performed a divination for her. He declared that her fate is to bear the curse of calamity. Consumed by malevolent energy, she is prone to bring harm to those around her. Such is the magnitude of the danger this poses, that her soul must be bound with red ropes to keep her homicidal instinct at bay. Oh, jeez. The red ropes have indeed served to keep her calmer and more content. They also seem to have rendered her somewhat inexpressive. Perhaps the red ropes are so powerful that they have suppressed some of her other emotions as well. It is only by fate that people's paths may cross. Now that Shen He's path has crossed with yours, please be sure to treasure the gift that fate has given you, and take good care of her. Oh, now Paimon gets it. You came out here to check up on Shen He because you were worried about her, didn't you? Huh. You dare draw such a facile conclusion on the nature of one's present excursion? <laughs> Incorrect. The truth is that while Liyue Harbor may seem peaceful today, danger is always lurking in the shadows. Ningguang once made a bold assertion that this is to be the era of the contract between Liyue and the humans. Well... One is most curious to observe how she will respond to the coming storm. If she handles it admirably, one is willing to be a witness to her achievements. But if she does not, the Adepti shall not hesitate to seize control. Let us conclude our conversation here for today. One has occupied enough of your time, and night is approaching. Be sure to get ample rest. Day. So, Shen He isn't an Adeptus after all. She just grew up around the Adepti. Oh, no wonder she doesn't like being treated as an Adeptus. Having everyone falling over themselves to show their respect all the time must be kind of hard to deal with. The human. Hmm. Fast forward time. Mm-hmm. Pretty mm -hmm. Check out the achievements real quick. Push out the world. Touch and go. You build to get a for Charging attack? Oh, did something good. <laughs> oh, jeez. I wonder if it was 8 a.m., right? Yeah.
You guys are getting sleepy? I'm getting sleepy. To be honest. But it's Friday. Most. Tomorrow's Friday. I'm so excited. Hey! So, Shenhua. Master has relayed my situation to you, I take it. Oh? How did you know? I'd intended to wait until you came back before going to sleep. But I didn't hear you come in. I was worried that something may have happened to you. So I went outside to check and caught sight mm. of my master. Good question. On top of this, Other than it's Friday, I don't know. I might continue this morning, story. Causing me to suspect that my master must have told you everything about me. I should continue After this all, story in the teapot quest tomorrow. Very talkative. <laughs> if I if I can, if I can. Was wrong. It's okay. I don't Saturday mind. Eve. <laughs> the fault is mine for not explaining everything to you sooner. Because in my experience, trying to explain is a futile pursuit. Still, though you mistook me for an adeptus, you never treated me as distant and unapproachable. Instead, you treated me as you would a friend. For this, I am very grateful indeed. To be fair, we've met our fair share of real adepti, too. Anyway, now it's settled. From now on, you're our friend. Whether you're an adeptus or a human isn't the important thing. First and foremost, we're just plain old friends. Got it. Although I don't know quite what it entails in terms of what I have to do, I must say I like the title, friend, very much indeed. Great! Well, uh -huh. now that we're all rested up, we What are you guys up to Friday night? What do you guys want to be up to Friday night? Let's go to the building site and ask Ningguang's little helper you know, how you know? progress is going. After all, Tomorrow, the Genshin and Star Rail store refreshes free wishes. Many competitors will Ooh! Really be oh, so we'll, it'll be down tomorrow night then, won't it? We'll be able to take things a little more Will it be down tomorrow night then, Turtle? Oh, Going to a land party? Oh, that sounds like fun, Momo. A place just outside. You go, girl. Yeah. Here's one for you, Shenhua. Try it. I haven't done one of those in years. I concur. It has a rich flavor, far more agreeable than those I've cooked. That's nah, just some stuff that refreshes. I don't know. Sometimes it's down for certain update thingy majiggies. And play TF2. Is the monthly refresher? Okay. Nothing crazy. TF2. What is TF2? That's not Team Fight Tactics. That's Team Fight 2. <laughs> uh. Team Fortress, okay. I miss Team Fight Tactics. I haven't played that in forever. Um, but it seems to be tied down by something. That's because it's not finished. Hey, Violin! And hey! Um, people Paimon doesn't know? Given the enormous scale of the Jade Chamber, we split the construction work into two phases to make sure the structure remains balanced. Before we find some suitable plostrite, we build the Jade Chamber's keel at ground level. Once the plostrite is ready, we place it into the keel and let the partially constructed Jade Chamber rise up to the height of the surrounding mountain peaks. The remainder of the construction work is then carried out at that altitude. Once everything is ready, I believe a rock makes it float. Tethers and allow the Jade Chamber to rise to its target altitude. Pretty awesome. Miss Bywin, we've brought some new materials to submit. One moment, I'll be right there. The construction work has only been able to progress this rapidly thanks to the plostrite provided by you. Lady Ningguang is most grateful and looks forward to seeing more of your work. 
Wow, can't believe you sourced the Plostrite so quickly. It's the key piece of the puzzle. Looks like you beat us to the punch. Wait, I know you. You're the one who fought against the Fatui and Osile, right? Oh, sure enough, your reputation precedes you. Pleased to meet you. I'm Beto, Captain of the Crux. Beto? Are you here to join the Jade Chamber Contest too? <laughs> sure am. I happened to get my hands on a chunk of Sunset Vermilionite on a voyage a while back, so I figured I'd bring it over. Huh. So even though it's rare, we're not the only ones who managed to get a hold of it. Oh, I've got some introductions to do. This is the renowned Miss Yun, or Yun Jin, probably the most famous figure in the Liyue opera scene. Greetings. These two are Pai Ma and the Traveler. I'm sure you've heard of them before. Rain, I just saw your message. Uh, sorry, I'm not sure we've met. Shenhe. Yeah, I don't think the characters are supposed to do that in your game. Mm. Friend. <laughs> Good to meet ya. Well, from today on, I guess all of us are friends. Miss Yoon is also here for the contest. Turns out she needed to borrow a boat, so we came together. It's an honor to finally meet you both. I've heard much about you. Miss Shenhe, though we are only meeting for the first time, I have a feeling that we will get along very well indeed. To be honest with you all, I am in great need of this opportunity to ask Lady Ningguang a question. That's why I joined the contest. Thanks to my father's connections, I was able to acquire a specimen of the Plostrite required. Fortunately, it was approved for submission, despite being a little on the diminutive side. Wow. I can snap, Mona. Ha ha, yeah, that one. That's hilarious. <laughs> I'm scared. But are you I'm scared to well? check it. No. Oh, no. Do you it? Okay. In that case, I have a proposal. Lady Ningguang said that the Why did it do it like that? Three materials will be <laughs> Why did it do it like that? I don't know. We'll try it again. Yeah. Special. <laughs> My phone made it even scarier. Oh, we could work together to secure the top three places between us. What do you think? How does it change things exactly? And then it got quiet. <laughs> Special. I think I see where you're going with this, Miss Yoon. The Plostrite was the most difficult item to source by a long shot. Luckily, all three of us managed to get our hands on it. The two remaining items aren't quite so rare, so as long as one of us finds a way to source it, the other two can hop on the bandwagon. How'd I do? Is that what you had in mind? Precisely. Huh. Interesting approach. Okay then. Alright, I'll go first. I have some leads on these wonder cores. From what I've heard, the core itself is really not that difficult to make. The hard part is getting hold of the ore used as raw materials. I'm gonna head back to the ship and ask Su Ling if he's heard of them. You guys... We will head into town and seek advice from Master Zhang of Hanfeng's Ironmongers. Thoughts? That was creepier? Yeah. Wonderful. We'll split into teams then, and whoever makes progress first brings all of us a step closer to victory. I'm gonna take off. See you later. Okay, let's go! By the way, what question are you gonna ask Ningguang Yunjin? I'm looking for a venue to host <laughs> the performance of our new opera. Lady Ningguang has excellent judgment, so I would like to hear her opinion. Ooh, what's the opera called? Paima wants to go see it! The opera is a labor of love by my father. He wrote it based on a popular urban legend about an evil spirit and an adeptus. It's called The Divine Damsel of Devastation. Okay. Alright. Where are we 
had it too. Far away. Not that far. We could teleport. Cheat. <gasps> Good night! Get some sleeps! I feel that, Momo. I think it's really time for me to sleep too. I'm getting distracted and sleepy. My focus needs more focus. Night night. You just got back too. No! How did you guys get back? All right. Well, we'll do one more thing then, real quick. Let's go see what they have to say. Hmm. Ah, hello. Are you here for something off the shelf? But I am very sleepy. Excuse me, Master John. I will just a tiny you bit. If you'd heard of something called a wonder core. Of course I wonder have. Core. Sorry. Um. Asking. Who's asking. My name is Yunjin. Perhaps you Yunjin. don't know me, but I believe that you forged some weaponry for my father in the past. One of the four noisiest Yunjin. characters in Genshin. Stage use. Oh. Pink water. So thank you. you. Must be Miss Yun. <laughs> Sorry. My brain's finally caught up. Uh, it's not used to doing much beyond bashing a hammer all day. Can you get the last one out? Everyone's heard of you, Miss Yu. But I have another one. Even folks who don't make it to the opera all that often. Hi, <laughs> Momo. So, Bye. So, mm -hmm. ask about Kisses from Momo. Now. As it happens, I do know how to make them. Matter of fact, I made some for Lady Ningguang back when she was building the original Jade Chamber. The types oh, of so he knows how to do it then. Wars ...are a little hard to come by. Lady Ningguang supplied them herself last time. I don't suppose you've brought any yourselves? No. We were gonna ask you what kinds of lore we need. <gasps> I hope I already have it. <laughs> Hug the sure. community game spot. You'll need two kinds. Stars yeah, we'll wake, wake some people up. Boy. If I remember correctly, Lady <laughs> Ningguang sourced her star splinter <laughs> iron from the Mount Tianhung area. They say it resonates with vision. Eyes in my same place. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. You made it. Water, you hit all right. If you stick with it, you'll find some eventually. As for the Sabrosia. Uh, hmm. We're going to start doing here. the things. It's all but unheard uh -huh. of in the market. <laughs> I'm on the attack. Uh, I'm really I attacked sorry. all the peeps. Sorry. What I've heard you have been attacked. around Mount Tianhung have some sort of magic trick that can pinpoint the location one more. of stuff. Of course, <laughs> you want my turtle likes to be splashed. He likes water. He's a water turtle. Mount Tianhung. And if you run into any locals, <laughs> ask him a few questions about Sabrosium. Mount Tianhung. Interestingly enough, the story of the Divine Damsel of Devastation also takes place on that mountain. I hear the view there is quite spectacular. I love that. Rara's friendship. I can totally remember some inspiration. Oh, poor cute Rara. Straight there. All right, let's see what burn this time. <laughs> Maybe you're a fire turtle. Maybe I was wrong. I came to Mount Tianung once with my father as a child. I remember it being such a long climb that I could barely feel my legs by the time we reached the top. <laughs> this is quite a trip down memory lane for me. Look at these majestic towering peaks and the gently flowing streams. It's like setting foot in paradise. No yeah, wonder the legend of the divine damsel of devastation is said to have taken place here. Adepti wander oft where mortals seldom stride. 
Indeed. This looks like a place that one might expect to be frequented by Adept Eye. The Divine Damsel of Devastation is your upcoming opera, right? And the story takes place in Mount Tianhang. Huh. Seems like you have a real connection with this place. What's the story about, though? It's the story of a girl becoming a hero. Cool. A hero story? They're Paimon's favorite! Paimon's so cute. The legend first arose in this area. It is said that there used to be a prosperous village on the mountain. In that village, there was a loving couple who were completely devoted to one another. Aww. One day, a terrifying monster appeared. Oh. The wife was out collecting herbs and was captured by the monster. Her husband was so distraught at the news that it broke his spirit and drove him to madness. Oh. The vile and vicious monster told the villagers, If you want to live, you must <laughs> sacrifice a child to me. <laughs> what a nasty piece of work! Ugh. Paimon sure uh. hopes this monster gets put in its place! But the monster was so terrible and so strong that all within the village were terrified of it. They had no choice but to give in to the monster's demand. Oh, jeez. Just while they were discussing whose child would be given over to the monster, a little girl suddenly stood up and came forward. Oh. Don't do it, little girl! Unbeknownst to anybody else, she was concealing an exorcist's blade. She approached the monster's lair, feigning fear and trepidation. When she finally arrived, she courageously drew her sword and entered into a fierce struggle with the monster, from which she eventually emerged as the victor. Her extraordinary abilities drew the attention of the Adepti, and they took her as one of their own. Her story became the stuff of legends. But alas, the paths of mortals and Adepti seldom cross, and she would never again re-enter the mortal world. And so, destined to grace the mortal realm for but a brief moment, she vanished like a wisp of smoke into thin air. <laughs> That's how the opera ends. Aww. I really like this story. It's about her! I personally think that perhaps the little girl was... not as brave as the opera makes her out to be. I'm not sure she deserves all the praise she is given. Hmm, I've never considered that before. Opera is always an interpretation of the events it purports to portray. A certain degree of deviation from the truth is always inevitable. When my father wrote the script for this play, I suppose his intention was to inspire his audience with the character of the Divine Damsel. Hmm. I think it's a great story. The ideal story. Well, it sure inspired Paimon! Let's go get ourselves some Star Splinter Iron! Yeah! <laughs> Oh, Star Splinter Iron. I guess it's up high or something. Don't even know. Acts like it's down here, but I'm sure it's up there. Once before, I think, but it's been a long time ago. We totally left the area. I don't know really how to get there. Let's see. Can I fly there? Like maybe it's just laying around on the ground then somewhere down here. Coming 
here, hot air balloons. Let's get it on. You don't like fire, do you? Oh, hot air balloons don't like fire. You have to use your vision? Oh, okay. The thing that never works for me, no matter how hard I try with the right character. Traveler, right? To use the vision. Does it make a sound? Hear sound. Can you use anyone? And how do I use my ability without the mouse? Because the the thing in the mouse that I used to just be able to push the button down. And it would use the vision, but it doesn't anymore. I wonder if there's another way to trigger the vision. You can change the key. Maybe. But the mouse button doesn't work anymore. Right, but my mouse button doesn't let me do it. It used to be the, the center rolly thing on my mouse. I would just like push down and it would do the elemental sight. But now it doesn't do it. I haven't been able to do it in forever. Unpheasant. Ew. I'm out. How to poke boss. I don't know. Elemental skill? Is that what it is? No. Elemental sight. Elemental sight. Probably not even gonna be on here. Give me my look. It's not a thing. Aha. Hold. See? It's hold the mouse button, but it doesn't freaking work. You cannot change the input method for this function? It's just broken! <laughs> so I literally have to hook up a different mouse, I guess, and hope it works. new mouse it is? I think so. I think it's time for a new mouse so I can finish this game. <laughs> uh, she just won't do it. So oh, there it goes! There it goes! It did it! <laughs> Got it to do it. Okay, never mind. Maybe not. Okay. Maybe it's user error. <sighs> It's working now, I don't know. Maybe I wasn't in the circle when I was trying before?
Oh, you can just leave it on? No. Hey, like, what is that? That's just fireflies. You have to hold it. I am holding it. It just stops as soon as I move forward. I mean, I can hold it and just stand here and hold it all day and nothing will happen. Is that it? Yeah. That's one. Oh, now it's gonna show me something on the thing? On top of the rock somewhere. There it is. There should be enough star splendor iron. Now we just need to find that Sabrosium. I think I saw a village on our way here. Master Jong said we should ask the locals for help. Why don't we try there? Yeah. Yes, it is. It was up there, right? You're like, it's not gonna be up there. <laughs> I found a piece up there. just passing by and wanted to ask if you happen to know anything about Sabrosium. <sighs> Is he trying to tell us to look for clues in the village? Well, whatever. Guess we're on our own here. Shenhua, Yunjin, let's have a look around. Sorry, you can go Is ahead without me. me. I'd like to have a word with this gentleman. If that's okay with you, Uncle Mingjin. It's... It's... Shen He. Shen He. You're alive. The rumors were true. So, all these years? I'm sorry, I don't know how to find Sabrosium. But I think you can find some information in the village. This place is deserted now. No one ever comes here. So you can rummage around all you want. Huh? You know this guy, Shenhe? Uh... Thank you, kind sir. We'll go and take a look around. Don't worry. Mingjin has no ill intention towards Miss Shenhe. She'll be quite safe. Okay. Then let's see what we can find in this village. Hmm. Hmm. I gotta go use my stuff again. There we go. Okay. 
Remains of a god, an abandoned village, Mount Tianhang. Does this mean that the true story of the Divine Damsel of Devastation happened right here, in this village? The time frame certainly matches, so it seems we're in the right area. Let's keep looking around. Hmm. Dang. Reading it. Uh -huh. So, Shenha is the divine damsel? Now that I think about it, she does behave rather like an adeptus, and she is about the right age. So that's why I've been getting the strangest feeling whenever I chat with her. I should have noticed it earlier. According to this text, the divine damsel from the opera Random cabbage was actually the there. daughter of the loving couple. And she didn't volunteer. She was sacrificed to the monster by her own father. Oh. The truth is even more lamentable than the opera. Now I understand why Shenha said the girl was not as brave as people think. It wasn't her choice to enter that ghastly situation. She was forced into it. Oh. It looks like my father may need to make a few revisions to his beloved opera. I don't know. She liked your story better. Maybe she doesn't want you to change it. Oh, treasure chest. Yes, I tried. Is this an answer from this world? This is it. Magic cream and silver so does so not wear. We need to go to the middle of the lake good. south of Mount Tianhong. Find us some suburbium. Let's go back and tell Shenha the news. Stand in the middle of the lake. Ba ba ba! I missed it. <laughs> Stand in the middle of the lake. Okay. That's what I got. One year when I was back visiting. I heard a story about a white-haired adeptus from a merchant passing by. I never imagined it was you. I was a very close friend of your father's. I could have stopped him from performing the summoning ritual. I had plenty of chances, but I couldn't bring myself to stand up to him. I just let things happen, let it all escalate. And, well, we all know how that story ended. I bring flowers back here every year. 
And each time I wish I had a chance to apologize to you. Apologize for what? If he'd stopped him, he'd only have found another way. There is nothing he wouldn't have done for his true love. Nothing. Do you still hate him? I don't know what I feel. I'm told my fate is to bear the curse of calamity, so my master bound my soul with red ropes to curb my aggression. But it also dampened my emotions, making me dispassionate, like the Adepti. So if you ask me how I feel about the past, if I hate my father or not, the truth is, I feel nothing at all. It must have been so tough for you all these years. Shenha, we're back! Oh, then I will leave you all in peace. Shenha, it brings me some solace knowing that you are okay. I'll tell you more about the old times next time we meet. Thanks, mister. We found some info in the end. Look, this tells us how to find Sabrosium. All we gotta do is go to the middle of that lake. <laughs> Let's go then. Let's go to the lake. Uh, Miss Shenha, there's something I'd like to talk to you about. Just now, in the village, we found your father's diary. It turns out that many of the details in the Divine Damsel of Devastation are not true to the facts. So I'd like to change them. Why? I know I say that opera always deviates from the truth. But now that the main character is standing right here in front of me, I cannot simply dismiss your lived experience oh, in favor of my father's fiction. It's okay. I like your version. Uh, huh? Oh, my dear. master once said that the day I learn how to use my strength for the good of others is the day that I can truly become part of human society. So, I hope that one day I might be brave enough to stand up and protect others, just like the girl in the opera. But I've never thought this way before, and I wonder whether I will continue to think in this way. Don't worry. I believe you will. In fact, I think maybe you've already started to become the person you aspire to be. You just haven't had the opportunity to see it for yourself yet. Shinra! Yinjin! Cut the chit chat! Let's go! <laughs> Paimon! I feel that, Paimon! You're always running out of those, right? It's like, hush, let's go. Anything I can help you with? Yes, let's go swimming in the lake. Out there with the duck. Face the duck. Oh. <laughs> I am like dust passing for some brosium, okay? I 
caught it. Just caught it. Woohoo. This is some top quality ore you found. I think I'll get a good end product out of these. Guess now it's my time to shine. Hey everyone, how's yep. the A team doing? <laughs> I ran into a bit of a brick wall on my end. Suling's never seen a wonder core before, and says it'd take a lot of research for him to get up to speed. Leave the wonder cores to me. I'll work on them while you go about your business. Don't worry. It won't take me too long. Much obliged, Master Zhang. We should look into the Adepti sigils next, but where should we find items relating to the Adepti? I'll sort that out. <laughs> so, uh, you got this then? Yes. I have been training with the Adepti for years. I know a thing or two about making sigils. When we first met, I told you I came for the Jade Chamber, not the contest. In fact, I came specifically to deliver Adepti sigils. Master heard that Ning Wang was planning to rebuild the Jade Chamber, so she sent me to deliver some Adepti sigils to her. Master also said she hoped that I can take this opportunity to rejoin human society. But now that I'm here, I wonder if I've been removed from the world for too long. There's so much basic knowledge that I lack. Maybe it won't work for me to stay here after all. But either way, I'm very glad to have met you. And I'll take care of those adept eye sigils. Without knowing the ins and outs of your situation, I can't say whether you should stay or not. But now that our paths have crossed, we'll always have a connection. So if you're ever feeling down, come find me on my ship. There'll be a drink waiting for you. Thank you. So, Master Zhang, I'll need to use your facilities to make the sigils. Fine by me. I'm actually curious to see how the Adepti arts work. Maybe I'll learn something. Maybe. Whew. The sigils are ready. Though they are in some respects inferior to my master's. I can assure you there will be no quality issues. I've finished forging the things you asked for, too. Great! Let's go submit them before someone else. I wanted to see what they look like. Can't get in these. Oh, there they are. Okay. Well, it's not that far out there. It's right there. But that should be where we stop. I'm gonna stop right there. I'm not gonna keep going for the night. I'm gonna leave you guys hanging and waiting for the unknown. So. Big me time. And time for me to head to sleep. So, you guys. Um, Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful evening. Yep. Get it. lots and lots of sleep. Thank you for being here. Thank you for hanging out. You guys are awesome. I will see you guys tomorrow. Maybe with some more Genshin. I'm gonna see how I'm feeling tomorrow. Whether I'm feeling like some party games or I'm feeling like some Genshin's. We'll see. We'll see. See what you guys are up to as well, so. Also, there is a chance, too, that I could just be completely exhausted. So, <laughs> we'll find out, but I hope to see you guys tomorrow. And I will talk to you guys then. Have a good night, Mono. Thank you, Bishop and Stromsy. Thank you, thank you, thank you.
Good night, all. Relaxing days like this are nice. Let's take it easy. <laughs> <laughs> 